Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to you, your friends and family. For today's video, it's going to be about my long-term relationship with the Fujifilm X-T4. I have nothing but amazing things to say about this camera. Quick context, I am a portrait and wedding photographer and this camera checks all the boxes for me. I'll throw in a couple reasons why. One is that it's compact and light. Two, it's all black, super sweet. Three, uh, the custom red shutter button. And four, I would say it just feels good to use or just feels good to hold on to. Um, it feels great. Just to quickly go over the specs of this camera is that it's a APS-C crop sensor, meaning that it's a smaller sensor compared to a full frame. And I think, correct me if I'm wrong, I think it's about 30% smaller than a full frame sensor. But the trade-off is that it's lighter. It is a 26 megapixel camera and it can shoot in 4K 60p at 4 to 10 bit. Honestly, anyone that's looking into doing weddings or portraits or both, I recommend this camera. Like this camera right here, like this guy here. Like this is a must, please get this, get this. So in this video, I will showcase you guys my favorite photos for, for portraits and weddings shot with this camera and plus some video. Let's get started. I absolutely love shooting portraits with my X-C4. Primarily because of the colors and the fact that you have the retro dials uh, that simulates using you know a classic film camera. Crazy thing about technology investment in sensors is that you can barely tell the difference in image quality between a, a crop sensor versus a full frame. For what I do, um, it's perfectly fine. For the work, the, for the type of work that I do that are just mainly portraits and weddings, it's perfect for me. The XC4 does an amazing job in low light situations and even if you see like noise in the photos it's a different kind of noise you see uh, comparably to Canon and Sony with Fujifilm's noise it's like really nice film noise The XC4 comes with Fujifilm's famous film simulation Film simulation digitally replicates the classic color look and black and white film. I guess you could say that I'm a bird photographer. <laughs> it's lightweight, compact. The, the autofocus is pretty good, but it's not like world class. Uh, comparably to Canon or Sony's autofocus, but it does its job. There are some weird oddities where like maybe some photos may look in focus on camera, but it isn't when you actually view it on, on, on your laptop or computer or tablet or whatever you use to edit your photos. Overall though, it's a positive experience for me. The X-T4 does exceptionally well for video. The colors that comes out of the camera is just amazing. Two, um, it does have F-Log, so it gives me the flexibility to grade the way I want the footage to look and feel. The only issue I have with the camera is that autofocus can be just a little bit better. Um, Fuji isn't known to have the best autofocus in the world, uh, comparably to Canon and Sony, but it works when it wants to work. Just 
just to summarize everything is that I love the camera for photos and video, hands down. Thank you.